top 10 Chinese dramas with growing online views, led by phenomenon existing 10 billion views. Some Chinese dramas lose their buzz after the finale, but others like Impresses in the Palace, the story of Mian Lan and Joy of Life keeps their momentum going strong. Years after they end, new viewers are still getting into them, and old fans are re-watching. Here are 10 Chinese dramas that have seen their online views consistently rise, including Love Like the Galaxy and Love Between Fairy and Devil. The last one is a phenomenon that has surpassed 10 billion views. Number 10. Fan Wei and Chin Hao in the long season An average increase of 22.1 million views per episode after the peak airing period. The suspense drama The Long Season is a masterpiece of Chinese dramas from 2023 with an impressive Douban rating of 9.4, matching that of Impresses in the Palace and Nirvana in Fire. It comes from the same production team behind the highly acclaimed The Bad Kids, so you know the quality is top-notch. With an all-star cast of seasoned actors and a fantastic script, it's got everything you want. Many viewers initially thought it was a comedy, but as the murder's mystery unfolds layer by layer, they realize it is a tragic story for everyone. The show only has 12 episodes and moves at a super fast pace, with each episode packed with intensity. It's definitely a must watch. The long season tells the story of taxi driver Wang Xiang and his brother in law Hong Bao as they investigate cologne taxes, only to stumble upon people closely connected to a murder case from years ago. Wang's son was a victim of that very case, and in order to find closure, he seeks out the detective Ma Tashang, who worked on a case back then. Reigniting a chase that spans over 12 20 years, but as the truth unfolds, time and space merge, leaving only the anarchy after fate in this song season. Number 9. Bai Yang Tian and Tian Chi Wei in New Life Begins. An average increase of 22.76 million views per episode after the peak airing period. New Life Begin is a recently popular ancient costume romantic comedy adapted from the novel Daily Life in the Qing Dynasty. It performed really well during its airing, and even after the finale, it still has good staying power. The show has a fast pace, is light hearted with plenty of laughs and while it throws in some drama, it rarely leaves you hanging since most issues get resolved by the next episode. It's a great watch for anyone who enjoys sweet historical dramas. New Life Begins cleverly blends modern values with a storyline about women's growth. Tian Shi Wei plays the sweet and naive female lead, Li Wei, in an adorable way, and she has great chemistry with Bai Ying Tian. The supporting characters are well defined, and the ensemble cast is portrayed beautifully. The show follows the story of Yin Xiang, the sixth young master of the new Chuan family, who is biding his time and Li Wei who just wants to live a, a comfortable life in her hometown. They marry first and fall in love later, embarking on a new life full of unexpected situations that complement each other perfectly. Number 8. Lei Jia Xin and Xin Bai Qian in a lifelong journey, an average increase of 28.52 million views per episode after the peak airing period. A lifelong journey is a highly acclaimed period drama from 2022 that dominated the charts during its airing, consistently ranking at the top of major lists in the first season of the year. After its release, the daily viewership ratings for the show existed 90 and it's maintained its position as a most-watched series, with an average rating of 2.850% on China Central Television. Other shows couldn't compete with its success, and it's also scored an impressive 8.4 on Dolmen, enjoying both critical acclaim and high viewership. Even after the finale, it continued to attract both new and old fans. A lifelong journey tells the story from the perspective of three generations of the Troll family, depicting the ups and downs experienced by over a dozen ordinary people over nearly 50 years. The plot is delicate, touching and sincere, filled with both laughter and tears, 
Watching the show offers a glimpse into the complexity of life, with a heavy atmosphere that still manages to bring humor. The script is genuinely well written. Number seven, Chuang Yi and Chuang Shunxi in Mysterious Lotus Casebook, an average increase of 28.88 million views per episode after the peak airing period. Mystery Lotus Casebook was a surprise hit during last summer's prime time. Adapted from a novel by Tang Pian, it's a successful martial arts drama with very little romance, but the plot never drags. Cheng Yi and Cheng Shunxi have great chemistry as a duo leads, and the story leaves a lasting impression. Mystery Mysterious Lotus Casebook scored an impressive 8.5 on Dubin, attracting new viewers with its good reputation, while old fans keep rewatching it. After the finale, Mysterious Lotus Casebook even launched mid-autumn festival activities and developed related star stage plays, showing a strong continuity. Mysterious Lotus Casebooks tell the story of Li Xiangyi, a renowned martial artist who was framed. Seriously injured and ends up falling into the sea, going missing. After surviving against the odds, he changes his identity to Li Lianhua. Due to a series of misunderstandings, people mistakenly believe he's a miraculous doctor who can bring the dead back to life. Along the way, he meets Fang Tiaoping, and the two join forces to unravel a series of mysterious death in the martial arts world. Number six. Wu Lei and Chao Lu Su in Love Like the Galaxy, an average increase of 29.53 million views per episode after the peak airing period. Love Like the Galaxy is one of the breakout hits of 2022, and like the story of Mian Lan, is adapted from a novel by Guan Qingzhi Luan. The series has a strong sense of continuity. The story combines the theme of revenge and palace intrigue, following the young generation Lin Bai Yi. Who carries a heavy family burden, as he teams up with Chen Shaoshang, a stay-at-home girl whose parents are often away at war, just to resolve the national crisis. Love Like the Galaxy features solid and exciting plot, with filming that feels grand and high quality, and every actor from the least to the supporting cast delivers great performances. The success of Like Love Like the Galaxy has also made Wen Lei. And Chao Lucy, some of the most popular post-95 actors today. Later, both Wu Lei and Chao Lucy released new dramas, but many viewers still can't forget Love Like the Galaxy. Number five, Yang Su Wan and Chao Qi Ka in Strange House of the Tang Dynasty, an average increase of 30.99 million views per episode after the peak airing period. The first season of Strange House of Tang Dynasty is a highly rated costume detective drama from 2022. It doesn't have any big name stars or an as blood level production, but it stands out thanks to its solid script and received great reviews. While bad or mediocre shows might spike in popularity for a moment, only truly good shows can leave a lasting impression on viewers. This year. The second season of Strange House of Tang Dynasty was released, and it maintained its positive reception, with the first season scoring an 8 on Dobin and the second season climbing to an 8.6. The script for Strange House of Tang Dynasty is really good, and the production team did a great job capturing the essence of the Tang Dynasty, with high-quality visuals and high logical reasoning. Thanks to the success of the first two seasons, a third season of Strange House of Tang Dynasty has already been confirmed. The story follows a skilled fighter Lu Lingfen at Di Kong's apparently shy Xu Wenming as they go from being at odds with each other to developing mutual respect, teaming up to solve tricky cases. Number four, Tan Qian Qi and Qin Qi Jia in Under the Skin. An average increase of 32.88 million views per episode after the peak airing period. The suspense drama Under the Skin has unexpectedly become a hit in recent years. When it first aired, Tan Qianqi was an even a popular actor, but Under the Skin gained traction thanks to its solid script and the actors' performances. The production quality and writing are top notch. The pacing is fast, and the story tackles hot social issues. 
the mystery solving and scraping with twists and turns that catch you off guard, making you want to binge watch episode after episode. Under the Skin follows Shen Yi, an enigmatic portrait artist who drops into the High Chung Public Security Bureau, teaming up with a hot headed, passionate cop Tu Chung to unravel a series of puzzling cases. A lot of viewers probably got hooked on Tan Jiang Chi after watching Lost You Forever and then went back to binge under the skin, right? Since the first season received great reviews, they got the original cast back to shoot the second season. Number 3. Yu Shu Xian and Dai Lian Guang in Love Between Fairy and Devil After the hot airing period ended, it averaged an additional 37.2 million views per episode online. Love Between Fairy and Devil is a blockbuster Chinese drama from 2022 and is really impressive. Two years after each air, its Dolben rating quietly rose to 8.2, providing that even after the show ended, many new viewers were getting into it, and they all had great things to say. Love Between Fairy and Devil became popular thanks to the director's sophisticated aesthetic and a delicate script and the actor's performances. Love Between Fairy and Devil is basically a story about a domineering dark lord falling for a sweet and innocent fairy. The plot and character set up a bit cliché, but it's both cheesy and sweet, making it totally addictive. Credit goes to the two lead actors for their portrayals. Dylan Wang plays the overbearing Dong Fang Ching Chang without being sleazy, while Yu Shu Xin with a naive Lan Hua is super adorable. The romantic storyline slowly builds up, and the typical plot twist in love between fairy and devil actually make it really entertaining, drawing in a lot of drama fans. Number 2. Zhang Rojun and Lee Kang Si in Swords No Stride After the hot airing period ended, it averaged an additional 45.99 million views per episode online. Swords No Stride is crafted by the same team behind Joy of Life, so you know it's got quality assurance. It had a lot of hype before it premiered, but after it aired, it doesn't get an overwhelmingly positive reviews like Joy of Life did. With a Doban rating of just 5.9, the show is set in the martial arts genre, but the fight choreography has faced criticism. Honestly, if you overlook the fight scenes, the storyline of Sword Snow Strike is pretty enjoyable. The screenwriter for Sword Snow Strike is also Wang Chuan from Joy of Life, and he still delivers a great script with clever political, maneuvering, and deep, complex characters that leave a lasting impression by the end. Even though the show doesn't have a ra high rating, its online views have surpassed 4.2 million, and many viewers are eagerly hoping for a second season. It tells the special art story of Su Feng Nian, the crown prince of Bei Liang, who transforms from a spoiled rich kid into a remarkable figure. Number 1. Chang Yi and Chang Shong Wen in The Knockout After the hot airing period ended, it averaged an additionally 172 million views per episode online. The Knockout is a blockbuster hit of 2023, considered as a real phenomenon level drama that has truly gone viral in recent years. Even with other popular mainland dramas like Immortal Samar Samsara and Till the End of the Moon airing in the same year, The Knockout is still leading by a mile. During its broadcast period, it racked up a total of 6.9 billion views, and after it ended, the views kept climbing, now surpassing 11.3 billion, breaking the 10 billion mark. The viewing numbers for the show are truly astonishing. The knockout is over 10,000 in popularity on IGG just 7 days after it's premiered, even surpassing the buzz of love between fairy and devil and my heroic husband, making it all-time champion on Ikaichi popularity chart. It's also the highest rated show on CCTV8 in nearly 9 years, with an average peak viewership at 2.5%. That's really impressive.